Hey guys, welcome back. Episode 30. This episode is going to put us at um, 300 hours. I mean, 300 hours, I wish. 300 minutes, which is 5 hours of recorded time. So that's fantastic, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> um, never really thought I'd be doing this, so, you know, it's pretty cool. I was just, I figured it would be a nice, a nice place to start the episode, just looking out my window into the beautiful field that I've got below. Um, I haven't done too much since last episode. Let's see, I went to the nether because I needed some more glowstone and I brought back 14 stacks and then I used like half of it, so yeah. Um, that glowstone went towards lighting up the... this area. I put a nice row of light all the way across the um, rail station thing, the railways, and I added a row up here because I, what I was trying to go for is that you would feel like this is the walkway and then this is the railway, and it really just kind of felt like I would, like I took a walkway and put a rail in it, and I didn't like that. So what I did was I lowered the ceiling one, so it feels more like this is enclosed in its own kind of thing, so that way, like, like they're separate modes of transportation, so... Yeah, so I did that, and I think I changed that with the destination part, which I may not have changed it on the other side as well, I'm not really sure. But yeah, I added that, and then there's light in the corners, because um, it was way too bright, I mean way too dark in these corners. Just in the corners where it's farther away, um, like this one would if it continued, but it has the um, light from all of this stuff going towards it. Yeah, destination home. Um, so that's the major changes that I've made since then is just this lighting, I think. Wait, did I show you guys that I redid it in brick? I'm not sure. Well, I redid it in brick, so that's cool. Um, I should really just come back in here and put um, light on all the walls, just like the same way I did up there, just looping all the way around. Except I don't know how I'd get it in like situations like this, because it could come down here and loop... <sighs> That's horrendous. I don't know how that got through. But there's got to be a brick somewhere. Ha! Nope. Don't get stuck up there. Okay. I knew it. <laughs> I'm crafty like that. Um, I wanted to lower this one, but I didn't have a bucket. And I still don't have a bucket. So... That's not going to be happening right now. Um, I would have totally changed all the inside stuff in here to cobblestone, I mean to brick as well, but it's too much effort um, for something so very barely noticeable. Um, but yeah, so this is what I've spent a lot of time on today. Um, redoing this whole thing here, and I forget, did I have this done last episode? I, I don't know. And I may just replace all the stone in this entire thing with gray brick, just because I hate how this looks. Like, I couldn't think of a good transition from the gray brick in here to the stone out here. And um, I wanted this to feel like a, like a station kind of thing, where, you know, you come down and you're going down and it looks different because it's, it's a landing that's all made of different stuff. So you step in here and this is part of the station, instead of it being part of the, the shaft. So, yeah. And, um, like I said, I went to the nether to get a bunch of glowstone. Um, I killed some zombie pigmen to get some gold chunks, or gold something or others. <laughs> um, there, I'm actually missing a, a gray brick down there, too, underneath the trap door. So I'll just take this. Stone bricks, that's what they're called. Same thing. Um, where was it? Oops. Um, let's see, I never mentioned it, but I did move this over um, from here because it just looked weird having them both on the left. I like having things symmetrical, so I made it symmetrical. Yay. Let's see, I think everything else is the same. Let's go check on our wheat because it's been a while. I wonder if I could... No, I'm not going to do that. Um, I was going to say, I wonder if I should hook up so that 
this button over here and it's broken again I fixed you I fixed you last time why would you do this to me okay see I don't know why it's doing this because this is the piston that's lagging behind all the others right um, or this wire right here is powering this piston not this one um, this one is getting powered from above and this should work but it doesn't and I mm. hold on I have an idea okay that didn't break anything Because the repeaters I use a lot as ways to transmit signal across without breaking anything. Because, <laughs> like, the way I had it over here was this repeater went into this block, but that would power redstone wire put underneath it. So what I did was I put a repeater there, So that, because the repeaters can only get powered from the one side. Um, so, okay. Now it should especially not be delayed. Because I've got... Oh, okay, never mind. Um, that should fix that. Uh, the power coming to the rest of the pistons goes up there. It's, that's, no. It's down somewhere. <laughs> I have so much. Oh, oh. What did I just fall into? Okay. I don't know. Oh. Okay. I dug this one time. So I could get down and... Oh, I just knocked some redstone off on accident. Um, this is the one that goes up. This loops back up into here. And this is the... This... Goes to that piston, actually. And this one... So that way... This one... This comes up goes over here, and that goes down to that piston over there, the bottom piston that I showed you earlier. And then this one up here goes to the rest of them. So they have the same delay because this repeater just extends the power signal. They branch apart here, and then that one goes down and split and goes through one repeater with a one tick delay. And then this one comes up here and goes through a repeater with one tick delay. And these ones are perfectly fine. They don't go through another delay. Um... So, I don't know why these aren't working. Um, they should, by all means, be working. Does that power it right? It, I think it's funny, because over here in this area, um, I can never... Okay, see, look, it worked perfectly fine right there. And how did I end up with an extra piece of redstone? Oh, you know what? I don't care. Um, so, it works now. And I'm not going to touch this again, but I can guarantee you that like the next time I log out, it's going to break. And we've got a full bunch of wheat, so let's just collect this, let it all slide into the trough, and then just hop down, pick it all up. Isn't that beautiful? That's what I wanted. Um, now, I really should have started with the back. Um... And that's exactly what I wanted, because I don't like having to walk over the um, soil to <clears throat> to plant the crops or to harvest them. And running back and forth for the crops is just ridiculous. Like, planting them in a big... Normally I would plant them in a big 9 by 9 square with water in the middle, because it water will hydrate up to 4 blocks away. Which, so this is as far away as I can possibly get from there. And the water can either be in the block of the soil or the block of the wheat. So that's pretty cool, which allows us to do stuff like this. Um, I've definitely, I, I will eventually come back in here and redo the looks in this place with gray brick and everything. Not right now, but it'll get done. I can guarantee that. I just keep finding new things to do, and I've, I've been, ab I've abandoned Skyrim almost entirely for the past couple days, and I feel so bad for it. And I really want to play some more, and I'll probably get back to that soon. So, um, if there's because I've just been running around doing so much stuff, like I wanted to do the like 
first I want to do the mob traps, and then I want to do the rails, and then I built this thing, and then I had all the wiring to do, and then I had, I wanted to redecorate everything, and I, <laughs> it was just, you know. But uh, right now, I think, my house is almost complete. I mean, I don't have much more stuff that I really want to do, um, in this house at least. Um, because, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, anyway, yeah. So that's the end of this video. Um, uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I had fun doing all the stuff that I just showed you. So that's good. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.